In one of my previous shots, we talked about currying and how a function like the one you see on your screen gives us the desired output as we can see in the console. But what if the number of arguments increases? Like, let me add another one. As you all can see, this does not work. And that is where something called as infinite currying comes in. The idea is simple. You keep returning a new function until no argument is passed. Let us see how to change this particular curried function into a one that is infinitely curried. So the very first thing that we need to do is we need to add an if condition where we do b is not equal to undefined. And what this will do is it will ensure that there is an argument passed for b. Okay. And if there is an argument passed for b, all we need to do is return add a plus b. Okay. So we have covered the scenario if there is a value that is passed for b, whereas if there is no value passed, then we simply need to return a. Okay. And now another thing that we need to do over here is this will return another function. So we will have to add an extra pair of parentheses over here just so that it will actually call it. And as we can see in the console, we get the desired output. And you can add as many values as you want and it will work just as fine as you can see. 